In number theory, Euler's theorem, also known as the Fermat-Euler theorem or Euler's Totian theorem, states that if n and r coprime positive integers, then a phi n one mod n Display style a caret varphi n equiv one p m o d n where phi n display style varphi n is Euler's Totian function. The notation is explained in the article Modular Arithmetic. In 1736, Leonard Euler published his proof of Fermat's little theorem, which Fermat had presented without proof. Subsequently, Euler presented other proofs of the theorem, culminating with Euler's theorem in his paper of 1763, in which he attempted to find the smallest exponent for which Fermat's little theorem was always true. The converse of Euler's theorem is also true. If the above congruence is true, then a display style n n display style n must be coprime. The theorem is a generalization of Fermat's little theorem, and is further generalized by Carmichael's theorem. The theorem may be used to easily reduce large powers modulo n n. For example, consider finding the ones place decimal digit of 7 222 7 222 i.e. 7 222 mod 10 display style 7 caret 222 pmod 10 note that 7 and 10 are coprime and phi 10 equals 4 display style var phi 10 equals 4 so euler's theorem yields 7 4 1 mod 10 display style 7 caret 4 equiv 1 pmod 10 and we get 7 222 7 4 times 55 plus 2 7 4 55 times 7 2 1 55 times 7 2 49 9 mod 10 Display style seven carat two hundred twenty two equiv seven carat four times fifty five plus two equiv seven carat four carat fifty five times seven carat two equiv one carat fifty five times seven carat two equiv forty nine equiv nine PMOD ten. In general, when reducing a power of a display style a modulo n display style n where a display style a and n display style n are coprime one needs to work modulo phi n display style var phi n in the exponent of a display style a if x Y mod phi n display style x equiv y p m o d var phi n then a x a y mod n display style a caret x equiv a caret y p m o d n Euler's theorem is sometimes cited as forming the basis of the RSA encryption system, however it is insufficient and unnecessary to use Euler's theorem to certify the validity of RSA encryption. In RSA, the net result of first encrypting a plaintext message, then later decrypting it, amounts to exponentiating a large input number by k phi n plus 
one Display style K varphi N plus one For some positive integer K Display style K In the case that the original number is relatively prime to N Display style N Euler's theorem then guarantees that the decrypted output number is equal to the original input number, giving back the plaintext. However, because n n is a product of two distinct primes p p and q q when the number encrypted is a multiple of p display style p or q display style q Euler's theorem does not apply and it is necessary to use the uniqueness provision of the Chinese remainder theorem the Chinese remainder theorem also suffices in the case where the number is relatively prime to n display style n and so Euler's theorem is neither sufficient nor necessary Topic. Proofs 1. Euler's theorem can be proven using concepts from the theory of groups The residue classes mod n that are coprime to n form a group under multiplication see the article Multiplicative group of integers modulo n for details. The order of that group is phi n where Phi display style varphi denotes Euler's totion function. Lagrange's theorem states that the order of any subgroup of a finite group divides the order of the entire group. In this case, phi n display style varphi n. If a display style a is any number coprime to n display style n then a display style a is in one of these residue classes and its powers a a 2 a k 1 mod n display style a a caret 2 l dots a caret k equiv 1 pmod n are a subgroup. Lagrange's theorem says k display style k must divide phi n display style varphi n, i.e. there is an integer m display style m such that k m equals phi n display style km equals varphi n but then a phi n equals a k m equals a k m 1 m equals 1 1 mod n display style a caret varphi n equals a caret km equals a caret k caret m equiv 1 caret m equals 1 equiv 1 pmod n 2 there is also a direct proof let r equals x 1 x 2 x phi n Display style r equals l brace x underscore one x underscore two l dots x underscore varphi n r brace be a reduced residue system mod n display style n and let a display style a be any integer coprime to n display style n the proof hinges on the fundamental fact that multiplication by a display style a 
permutes that x i display style x underscore i in other words if a x j a x k mod n display style x underscore j equiv x underscore k p m o d n then j equals k display style j equals k this law of cancellation is proved in the article multiplicative group of integers modulo n that is the sets r display style r and a r equals a x 1 a x 2 a x phi n display style r equals l brace x underscore 1 x underscore 2 l dots x underscore var phi n r brace considered as sets of congruence classes mod n display style n are identical as sets they may be listed in different orders so the product of all the numbers in r display style r is congruent mod n display style n to the product of all the numbers in a r display style r i equals 1 phi n x i i equals 1 phi n a x i equals a phi n i equals 1 phi n x i mod n Display style prod underscore i equals one carrot var phi n x underscore i equiv prod underscore i equals one carrot var phi n x underscore i equals a carrot var phi n prod underscore i equals one carrot var phi n x underscore i p m o d n and using the cancellation law to cancel the x i display style x underscore i S gives Euler's theorem a phi n one mod n display style a caret var phi n equiv one p m o d n topic Euler quotient. The Euler quotient of an integer a with respect to n is defined as q n a equals a phi n minus one n display style q underscore n a equals frac a caret var phi n minus one n the special case of Euler quotient is Fermat quotient, it happens when n is prime. A number n prime to a which divides q n a is called generalized Weferic number to base a. In a special case, an odd number n which divides q n 2 Display style q underscore n two is called Weferic number. The least base b greater than one, which n as a Weferic number, are t 
2, 5, 8, 7, 7, 17, 18, 15, 26, 7, 3, 17, 19, 19, 26, 31, 38, 53, 28, 7, 19, 3, 28, 17, 57, 19, 80, 19, 14, 107, 115, 63, 118, 65, 18, 53, 18, 69, 19, 7, 51, 19, 19, 3, 26, 63, 53, 17, 18, 57. Sequence A250206 in the OEIS. Topic. See also Carmichael function Euler's criterion Fermat's little theorem Wilson's theorem Notes <laughs>